Hi, I'm Brian with ericksontutoring.blogspot.com. Today we're going to discuss the function of cellulose. Um, first of all, cellulose is a organic compound. It's actually a polysaccharide, which means uh, it's a long, uh, long chain of sugars. And in particular, cellulose is glucose, which comes from photosynthesis, um, a whole long chain, up to thousands of glucose molecules connected end to end. Um, they're connected in a really straight line, and uh, because of the structure of glucose, um, one strand will actually hydrogen bond, um, which is a form of weak bonding, to other strands, forming sort of like tubes and, and, and bundles called microfibrils. Um, cellulose itself is responsible for providing the strength and, and sort of structure of plant leaves. Um, it forms this crisscrossing fabric or, or this weave inside of the cell wall and it really gives that strength and rigidity that we come to associate with plants. Without it, plants wouldn't be able to stand up. Um, their leaves wouldn't be able to maintain shape, any, all those sorts of things. Um, it, it sort of serves as like a rebar reinforcement in concrete. That's what it does, but in plants. Um, it can also be used in all sorts of things. It's used to make explosives, it's used to make paper. Um, actually, 90% of, of raw cotton is cellulose, which gives it that nice um, strength. Um, so that's essentially the, the a discussion of the function of cellulose.